Guys, we are back with Josh Cullen, Wild Tonight in the Dark. And those are the behind the scenes. Um, we're gonna watch episode one, episode two, and episode three. There's the recording, the dance rehearsal, and MV shoot day one. I would just wait it so I could combine all of them because they're quite short. So we're gonna watch them today and I'm excited. There is subtitles, so let's watch this together. Also, congratulations to Josh for 1 million views. He reached 1 million views yesterday. So, yay. Okay, guys, make sure to subscribe, give this video a like, and let's watch this together. Getting wild tonight, getting wild tonight. Getting wild, it's... Ooh. I wonder, like, the timeline. When did he record this? What's up, fellas? How we doing today? Hi, my name is uh, Ace Santos, and I'm a music producer and uh, oh, song that's his cousin and cousin for Josh Cullen. Together, we made Wild Tonight. Josh is a visionary, man. Like, he has so many ideas coming into it from the from a listener's perspective. Wait, let me let me know. Honestly, I have struggles, uh, which is I don't decide sa mga ad libs ko na dapat ipasok sa music na ito. Kasi parang feel ko pag pinakikita ko siya, puno na siya. Pero gusto ko pa rin lagi ng palabok kung tawagin niya, ng something na uh, pwede pwedeng ma-enhance pa siya. Mm, I really liked what he did on the Wish Bus. Those were amazing ad libs. Hi, this is Gani Palabiab, and we are in Monastery Studio. Monastery Today we're gonna Studio. We're recording some vocals uh, with Josh Cullen. In the darkness. Oh, sorry, isa pa po. In, <clears throat> in the darkness, I think I feel your heart beat. Your... Oh my God, isa pa po. <laughs> in the darkness, I think I feel your heart beat rising. Perfectionist. Oh my god, yeah. Artists are all perfectionists. Like when it comes to your craft, you just want it to be so perfect. This is so interesting. Also for Josh, it doesn't come as natural as it would come like, you know, for Pablo to like make ad-libs and find harmonies. And you can really tell that Josh put in so much work in everything that he does. Josh is such an inspiration. Oh, that's the timeline when they were in Davao. October? Oh. Yeah, that's my favorite part. Like, you know, like, like that, that super stoner. Yeah, that's the one that Don't I was going like, like a bone we fly. Ain't nobody gonna blow my that or, or like I come from a background of like, yo, I used to make chip tune, like video game BGM. And then I also used to be in like hardcore bands. I used to be in like punk bands, stuff like that. Um, 
I did mm -hmm. jazz for a bit. I rap for a bit. Did, like, he lives in the Philippines, popular. right? Because like, I know he has different. family so in like, I want a song LA. Goes in clubs, man. And I was like, I've never made one of those before. <laughs> Oh. And it was like 3 a.m. I was still in Phoenix. And um, I was like, hey, you want to try like making a beat together? So, is that the cousin that lives in America? He uses FL Studio Room. That was for the drop. But did it go with melodic? But did it ano? Parang chill drop. Oh. This is nice, but I want this to feel like this. Like this is the hardest though for someone that doesn't produce music to have the vision in their head and trying to tell someone else what they want because they, they obviously you need to know producing to be able to put the sound that you have in your head. It's so good. Oh. You can tell how this just comes so naturally for him compared to when we just saw him singing. The rap just. Yeah, well, tonight is just, it's its a really, it's not benchmark. I don't know the word right now, but it's like, it's a really interesting point for me and for Josh, like as a person, because I feel like it's like the collision of like two different uh, perspectives on music and on creativity as a whole, because um, Josh obviously is like, Super big star. He's been in the industry for a long time. Super experienced. I hear the people crying. The sound is so inviting. I hear the people crying. The sound is so inviting. Ah, so what's up? Hit. Name water for me, Jan. Basically, the title of the wild tonight is it's it's actually an introductory song for myself. Dito ko ipapakilala ko sino talaga ang tulong nito. Right. That's the first. The first is even more pressure because it's like you just people don't know who you are as a brand yourself. This is what shows them what you are. Oh, that was good. The song is actually like so amazing. Now, after so many listens, like I'm obsessed with it. Hi everyone, my name is AJ and I'm the choreographer of Wild tonight. 
So yung process ng pagbuo ng Wild Nights, it, it was really exciting because ano sa mahirap na madale. Mahirap in a way na parang of course ako as a choreographer I have my own vision when it comes to doing the whole choreography nung narinig ko yung music meron na gusto akong gustong mangyari ganyan but later on nung syempre kailangan ko i-consider si Josh yung artistry niya mas feel ko siya ngayon Then nung narinig ko yung mga insights niya it's really ano helpful sobrang ganda rin nung approach niya kung paano niya gusto talaga makita yung choreography and nagmeet kami halfway kung paano namin i kokolab yung mga inputs namin and everything and i believe yung nabuo naman namin it's really wild Wow. Oh. Damn. Okay, now I want to see that, but at the right speed. That looks so hard to do. There's so many movements. And there's just so many... Wow, I love that. Because the, move, the moves, they're just in the air, on the floor, and they're like... Oh, he looks good in that light. And then... Well, actually, ano eh, parang wala nang ano-ano, pero naisip ko agad si Aero. Sabi ko, feeling ko, perfect siya, fit siya for the, ano talaga, for the team. So, minessage ko na agad siya, binigyan ko na siya ng heads up. So, uh, that was like six months ago ata, parang gano'n, or mga gano'n, six or four months ago. Tapos, nagplano na kami, gano'n, sinad ko sa kanya yung music, para lang ma-feel niya, gano'n. And then, sabi niya, game agad siya, parang, sige bro, pasabugin natin yan. So, na-excite kami pareho. Then, ayun. It became reality, di ba? Oh, this is so satisfying. Wow! <gasps> Una, um, sabi ko, tara, gawa na natin. Ito, Damn! Ito, 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 ng rehearsal date, ganyan. Tapos sa first day ng rehearsal, ayaw niya akong panoorin. Sabi niya, Wag mo na dito, ako muna hayaan mo muna ako gumawa. Tapos next time ko tignan ko na lang daw kasi na-pressure daw siya. Oh. Oy, what's up? What's up? Sabi ko okay lang sa akin 'yun. Sabi niya, hindi na hihiya ako eh. So hinayaan ko muna siya. Syempre, gusto ko rin maging comfortable sa iyo noon. Then pinakita niya sa akin yung video after ano yung kinagabihan noon sabi ko wow sabi pag unang beat pa lang unang bar pa lang ano na eh pang uh, hip hop international lalaban na eh sabi basta dito common wala pusta hindi mo inakala ako yung magigising nga si yung panggagambala nagaabang magamali nakamasid lahat pero wow si seeing this from this angle is so different because it seems like we're with them You're not watching them, you're behind them. Grabe ito ah, sabi ko, sobrang, sobrang lakas. In fairness, grabe wala akong masabi, ang lakas. Pero in a way, meron na ako na vision out doon kasi sa choreography. Basta ako sinadjust ko, ano ah, kayo bala. Hindi, joke lang. Kayo naman yan. And doon sa bawat, para kasing ano yan eh, nakasegregate per section yung storyline or yung ano ng kanta ko. So meron na ako na vision out and sinabi ko sa kanya ganito kasi yung nafe-feel ko talaga ayoko nang ayoko na sobrang lakas kaagad kasi baka parang mapagod sila and at the same time mapagod din yung nanonood parang gusto ko medyo storytelling and may, may dynamics
naman, nag-meet naman kami sa halfway, tapos pinaba- binago niya ulit, pirevise niya, tapos nakita ko, um, o oh, halos, parang nasa halfway na kami, tapos inano ko pa, tinuwik ko pa konti, para lang talagang makuha yung gusto kong feels. Ayan. Quiet please! <laughs> Hinaalang ka mo konti. So ayun, um, kinakabahan po ako, so, this time kong mag-shoot ng music video. Na ganito ka complicated, ganito ka dami yung kailangan gawin. Kasi syempre, mag-isa ako, bukod sa mag-isa ako, ang dami kong pinasok na ideas. Hopefully. Look at him with his little microphone. Ako na matino, kasi oh, so na, professional. Na, na rin ako eh. Kahit yung mga simple ad-libs, very attention to detail tayo. I'm excited for part one of the shoot. I wonder where they shot this. Because there were so many sets, like... The castle was mostly CGI. Did they shoot in Manila? The day of our music video shoot. I don't have I don't want to sleep because I'm so excited and at the same time I'm stressed. Mm. I'm thinking about the shot list. But it's fun because we have a long day ahead. <laughs> yes, I just want to thank you. Did they do that first? Of course, who made this reality. Of course, before it was just a plan. And now, the shoot will happen. And I hope it's smooth and uh, Successful, sure, lahat, and maging isang ayon kung paano natin yung isip. So, yun lang po, tulad ng sinabi, sure, lahat, ngiti lang po tayo, and let's do a wonderful shoot today. Let's, okay. wow! play out um yun yung mga nangyayari sa loob ng utak ko yung parang kung iaano mo si Josh Cullen pag nagiging pag nagiging transparent kasi ako sa tao they tend to misunderstand di ba kung ano yung mga nasasabi ko very kasi mayroon ako commanding ano masyado eh siguro yung aura and yun nga as someone na alpha or marami kasi ako na pagdaan ng struggle so parang Medyo yung traits ko, ganun na siya. Ganun na ka-strong. So, pag may, may ginagawa ako, gusto ko nasusunod. <laughs> In a way, ganun-ganun. Control freak niya. Pero yun yung nasa loob ng utak ko. As Josh Cullen, and ayun nga, as someone na vampire dun sa music video na yun. Marami rin akong easter eggs na iniwan sa music video. Representation. Even the Dr. Plague. Ayoko sana ibigay basta-basta yung ano, yung answer for it. Pero, very obvious naman kung bakit. Please give us the spoilers. I wanna know everything. Special effect that is wow. Turn up the 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 the
trabaho lang. Alam kong binibigay nila yung puso nila sa ginagawa nila. Kaya mas nafe-feel ko siya na ginaganahan ako. Mas gusto ko ibigay yung best ko din. And proud ako na kasama ko sila ngayon. Parang sila yung kasama ko na feeling ko hindi ako ipapahiya kahit sa ako mag-perform. sa layout club, the red suit. Um, Doon ko pinapakita yung you have awakened the beast and I'm unstoppable. I have my friends with me. I have everyone who parang kung sino yung mga naniniwala sa akin. Ah, uh, Dion, syempre. Nandito ang Dion at nakakatawa na ma'am. Sinusuportahan ako ng mga ibang P-pop groups. So, very overwhelmed. So, nandito po tayo ngayon sa birthday party ko. Sa lahat ang nakikita nyo ang mga guests ko. Free drinks for everyone. Did they shot this at a club? No one can stop me. Kahit anong gawin nila, kumbaga nandito pa rin ako sa tuktok. Yung pinaka-mind-blowing na naisip ko doon, siguro yung yung tato, yung UV tato. Oo, yan. Unahin natin, tsaka siguro sa... What do they use? It's a, it's a pen. Damn, this, that must have taken so long. Wow. Hard work paying off. It is! <laughs> we know by now that Josh does not, does not age. That's his thing. Parang never pa ako nakakita, so far ah, dito lang naman sa Pilipinas, na may concept na ganun. And tagal ko na tayo gusto gawin yun. I've been waiting all my life for this moment. <laughs> Damn. Oh, I'm excited for the next part. I don't know if it's every week. Wow. The music video behind the scenes, that is so interesting. I love, you know that I love behind the scenes. And I love, I feel like for me, the most interesting things is to see the process that leads up to the final result. I also love seeing how they produced the song, the idea, how it came about, how long it took them. It's just, you need to know, to, you really like appreciate things even more when you find out everything that happens. And Josh is such a leader in a way that he knows exactly what he wants. 
And so it's so it makes it so easy for everyone because his vision is already so strong. So every time someone would probably ask him, so what should we do here? He would know. He just knows exactly what it has to look like, what it has to sound like. And the final result is amazing. So many visions, like if you think about it, so many so many sets, so many outfit changes, he really went all out because there was so many different things. So it took him probably way longer to film because they had to always reshoot for all like the black outfit, the vampire outfit, the rave outfit, the UV outfit, like, and the plague outfit. So many of them like, wow. Such hard work. And it's so nice. This is my first time actually seeing his cousin. I don't think I've wa I've seen him before. So that's really interesting. And it's so cool that it's just like keeps in the family, you know. You know. And Josh is just so hardworking. Oh my god, he deserves. He deserves the best. And also, I'm so happy about the behind the scenes like they they're so professional like he has the microphone he has the subtitles it's just so enjoyable for a fan to watch when the he put so much like great quality this is what i love and yeah oh my god i really want to see also him reacting to the music video like when he saw it for the first time that would be so good if he filmed his reaction just seeing the final product because everything is in your head but then or like listening to the song for the first time because seeing and hearing something that was in your head for so long that just like must mean so much to him and i want to see that i really hope we're getting more and more episodes and i really enjoy this it was so good anyways guys thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next video